traditions of that country and the language of that country. That said, despite my, uh, my father's obvious omissions, that was something ultimately European about him. And I think one of the things the, the war taught him is I think it, it teaches everyone who is, who is from these lands uh, is that the culture is this incredible vessel that compresses so much, it distills so much, and it is in our movies, our books, our paintings, our sculptures that a world can survive. Um, so consequently, I was, uh, I was raised with long discussions about, uh, about philosophers, about the importance of, uh, of music, whether it was Beethoven or Bach, or, or, or philosophers who were as kooky as Heidegger, or, or you know, progressive as Habermas, or the wonders of, uh, of Goethe or Rilke. Um, and then, of course, the, the filmmakers, whether it was uh, Fritz Lang or Lubitsch or, or, or others. So, there was a, you know, there was always a constant theme of, of, of world literature, world philosophy, world art, and world movies, and, and of course, uh, I guess a little some of that. Uh,